Bob Sansevier, I'm here with Pioneer Press Vikings beat reporter Rick Alonzo and Pioneer Press Deputy Sports Editor John Plume. Rick, uh, the, the ankle surgery is done for Brett Favre. That would erase any doubt, I would think, that he's coming back. Is that, uh, is that the way you see it? That's the way I see it. He was told he needed to have the surgery to play in 2010. He had the surgery, so you would think that clears all the roadblocks and uh, sets up uh, another year for him. John, why has it become like this Viking, the, the, the uh, drama Viking? This, why not just say, yeah, nobody, nobody cares if he doesn't show up until after they break Mankato. Is that why he doesn't want to say, I'll play, but I'm not coming to training camp? Is it, I mean, it's like the worst kept secret out there that he doesn't want to go to training camp. He doesn't get enough attention at home. So he needs know. this kind of attention? Yeah, I think so. He's a prima donna. Why not? If he can stay in the news, it's great for his career. Keeps it, him going. You think it's as simple as that, Rick? He just doesn't, he wants the attention <laughs> and craves it? Well, you know, a lot of the stuff that happens with him in the off season is very interesting. You know, he does things like Jay Leno, you know, he, he, uh, he or his camp or somebody in his family or somewhere, somebody is leaking stuff to ESPN about various things here and there. And so, I mean, it's interesting because he's always in the news, it seems like, um, even though he, he himself, you know, doesn't speak that often. What do you think, John? The Columbia could be. He has some marketing. I mean, he's got this the the, uh, the jeans thing. He's done stuff with Sears. It's really to keep him in the news for those things. You think it's all it's all plotted out well in advance to uh, to keep him up there? I mean, maybe that's what he wants for a career when he gets done to be a pitch man. Because I, I don't see him being be a the, shell. I don't see him being in the booth. You know, well, going he, to games be, week be, after week. He but, might be pretty entertaining for that. You know, he's a he's a really good speaker. He likes to talk. He's does a great job on those commercials, so if you want to stay in the news, he, he certainly knows how to market himself. Speaking of liking to talk, we'll talk again about fire, I'm guessing, one of these days.